Hi, welcome to today's QGIS tutorial lesson one. In this video, we will learn how to download and install QGIS latest version, which is QGIS 3.14. What you will need is a computer and an internet connection. So let's get started. So you will choose the browser that you're going to use. For my case, I'm using Google Chrome. On the search button, we will search for QGIS, QGIS, and hit enter. Then we will select the first uh, link, which is Welcome to QGIS Project. It will take us to the official website of QGIS, and this is uh, where you are, we are going to be able to download QGIS, and, the, and it says QGIS is a free an open geographic information system so you can decide to support QGIS if you feel that later on after you've worked with the QGIS and feel that it's actually helped you learn a lot and it has uh, helped you in your projects so you can decide to support them by donating to them but now we are interested in just downloading the QGIS so we're going to click on download Will take us to another window where there is uh, installation downloads all releases and sources all releases is uh, the, the previous releases we're going to look into that but let's just first scroll down and see what options we have so we have the option of download for windows we have also download for mac, mac os we also have download for linux we also have download for BSD and you also have download for mobile tablets so depending on what you which which uh, machine you want to, to install it on it you just have to do your selection or currently we are going to do as uh, we're going to install our QGIS on our desk on our computer uh, Windows uh, computer so we're going to select either uh, uh, the, the latest release which is 3.14 or the uh, long-term release which is more stable which is QGIS 3.10 that was the previous version so I'm just going to before we, we start downloading QGIS I'm going to now select this other tab just next to the install download which is all release and it will tell you the previous releases of QGIS are still available here so you can select that and it will take you to a window where you will get all the previous releases and there are very very many many releases from the QGIS trip from the QGIS 1.4 to and there, there are actually so many so I can't I can't go through all of them right now what you're interested in you're interested in the latest version which has which is updated so to know if your computer is 32 bit or 64 bit you'll go to our search button here down here on, on the on next to start and we'll type d x d i a g we want to just get information about the computer and i'll select this run command and it will bring my bring up my information and you can see this is a 64-bit laptop right so depending on what on, on, on what your laptop is you can decide to choose which one you so it will it will actually help you to determine what you're going to be choosing when installing so I just click on exit now I want to install the 4 bit which is 3.4 for many professionals usually like using the 3.10 because it's more stable right now but we're going to use the 3.4 which has it has more features and it is the latest version so I'm going to select the 3.14 and it will prompt me to download depending on the download that you have it will prompt you to download and it's 480 MB quite a very small file so depending on your on how fast your internet is you 
you'll be able to download it in a few minutes. So I'll click on start download. It actually takes some time, so I'll pause the I'll, I'll, I'll forward this video and we go to the next session, the next uh, session, the next uh, step, which is uh, to install the QGIS. location where our download go, where we download our, our QGIS, where we download, we saved our QGIS. It's QGIS 3.14. Right click on, on the set on it and run as administrator. Click on yes. The installation process pretty takes pretty much takes around five to ten minutes depending on the on how quick your computer is. I'll click on next. I'll click on agree. Next. And the installation is start running. And it will take quite some time. So I'll fast forward this video and then we go to we, we now see the complete installation of QGIS.
after the installation is complete we'll click on the finish button to finish the installation and then we'll go to our desktop where we'll find a folder QG 3.14 you'll find a folder QG 3.14 actually I have very many more QG, QGS on, installed on my computer the beauty about QGS is that you can install as many versions as possible and it will not overwrite the existing of previous versions so I have uh, my 3.14 folder here when I open it my QGIS shortcuts are in in uh, and i will select the qgis desktop 3.14 right click on it and open and that is how you install qgis 3.14 on your windows computer If you found this video useful hit the like button and and, su and subscribe to this channel for the remaining 29 lessons on up and running with QGIS 3.14 thank you